My name is Emic, and this is my one-man show. And I'm hanging out at the People's Art of Portland Gallery in lovely Portland, Oregon. I did this poster over here back in 2007. I was listening to the Decemberists because it's required when you first move to Portland. And the Decemberists have a lot of visuals and a lot of storytelling uh, in their music, especially old whaler stories. Um, and so I wanted to do a different twist on a whale, which just seemed like something that, I don't know, it just seemed really obvious. If, if you listen to their first few albums, there's lots of whale references. I did this poster back in 2005, and once I got the idea, I knew that riffing off of the band's name, I had to get Red Velvet to print this on. This poster, printed on Red Velvet, won the Polestar Awards Poster of the Year in 2005, first place. And it shows a bone gun with a broken heart and a bullet hole of a broken heart. And uh, the rest is self-explanatory. So I am now in the Electric Mayhem room of the People's Art of Portland Gallery. It's a special room for all of my light boxes that I've done and other posters, rock posters, that light up in some way or another. I've been making hundreds of posters for 20 years and I decided to do something new so I thought why not print on different types of materials that can also be lit up. Um, this particular poster over here was done for Queens of the Stone Age. I just wanted something kind of devilish and like the dark side of go-go dancing. It's a three-eyed skull with strippers and pulsating red lava uh, lenticular paper. One of the things I really enjoyed about this show, besides hundreds of posters that I had in the gallery for the month, was these 35 little doodles that I got to draw. Because I love drawing, but it's always for a commission. There's always a deadline, there's always an end result, it's always for a project. And these little drawings were just kind of off the top of my head, just for fun. And it just allowed me the freedom to kind of be silly, have fun, and uh, see what I can come up with for no reason other than I the joy of drawing. I like the idea of a gallery at the mall. It's just, it's cool. You have a lot of people that come here not even knowing there's a gallery, not even considering it or thinking about it, and then they walk in and they're just like, wow, we gotta, we gotta tell our friends about it. And, and it's like, slowly since this space has been here, every opening gets bigger and bigger and there's like more word of mouth. And I kind of like that kind of, it's underground and yet it's in the most visible place there is. It's bringing culture to the belly of the beast.